Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to erase or wipe EFS on Samsung S8 or Note 8. They all have the same method. Any revolution, any latest model, any latest um, Android version. So what you have to do, first put the phone in a download mode. So my phone is S8. Uh, here you go. So once the phone in a download mode, power off, volume down, Bixby and power key. You just click on Odin. It's a special Odin, patch Odin. So okay, you just click on here. You put the combination file. You can easily get it from Android file host. It depends like which... Uh, uh, Android version is running on your phone. So if your phone is on 8.0 you and the revolution is 3 Then you need to match the revolution. So once you put that and I'm just gonna put start and it will Start downloading. I mean like it will start flashing it That's it. So it's gonna come here. It's gonna take some time. My computer is a bit slow this one it's Just that I just wanted to show you how to I'm just gonna pause the video here because it's gonna take um well, usually just take one, two minutes or may, maximum four or five minutes. But my, this computer is really slow. So it's going to take some time. I'm just going to pause the video here. Once it says finish, I'm just going to start playing it again. So, so once it says past there, uh, the phone will come to this screen. It says the Samsung factory binary. And then it will bring you all the way to this screen. When you are in this screen, you just go here, press IMEI. Once you press the IMEI, so you need to put this code star pound three three seven two five three two seven pound, and then you just put the erase one, and then you put the number two. Yes. Okay. So it says the EFS was clear. Now you need to reboot the phone. So just gonna restart. So my son is sleeping. <laughs> so you can hear him snoring. I do all the stuff like while he's sleeping. Okay, so power on. So the phone is still on running on the um, combination. Mm. Okay, now the EFS is wiped, so I mean I should be all zeros. There you go. That's a very simple way of um, erasing any IMEI like if you want but, but you know you should know what you're doing so don't just do it this is video is only for the people who want to erase the EFS or or the IMEI or like for any other purposes so always make a backup always back up your QCN and um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video let me know how it was or where I need to work on it and if you need any help, let me know. I'll just answer all your questions. Okay, thank you for watching.